the Customs Division of the Ghana Revenue Authority realized that for about 15 years, it was about time to take over its core functions of valuation, risk management and inspection of goods that entered into Ghana through the various trading outlets of ports and borders. Thus, Customs decided to take over these functions from the destination inspection companies as of September 1st, 2015, with technical support of a private partner, the West Blue Consulting. And ever since the takeover of these core functions of Customs, exactly a year ago, several innovations have taken place to position Customs in the capacity to undertake these duties to improve the ease of doing business in Ghana. One of the major steps taken from the early stages was the establishment of the Customs Technical Services Bureau Help Desk. A toll-free number 080-266-266 was introduced where calls were received on a daily basis to assess, guide and aid declarants who had no foreknowledge of the pre-arrival assessment reporting system, which was the first phase of the overall National Single Window Project, as well as some of its latter components. There were various options of having to walk into the help desk, sending emails to the support center, making use of the live chat on the Ghana Trading Hub portal, making use of the various social media platforms, and placing calls for various forms of assistance. With the success recorded so far, there has arisen the need to expand the operations of the help desk to all key areas such as the Tema port, Kotoka International Airport, Takrali port and the Aflao border in order to place the operations of the Ghana National Single Window at the doorstep of the trading public who are the principal beneficiaries of the project. Therefore, with the support of West Blue Consulting Limited, the technical partner of Ghana Customs, a state-of-the-art electronic help desk facility put together by Africans have been built at the Tema Port in the Kotoka International Airport called the E-Zone. The E-Zone, an ultra-modern help desk built to address concerns of the trading public and assist them through the national single window processes, will have three major functions, a customer service center, a walk-in sales service, and an e-payment service point. In the case of the customer service center, although a lot of efforts have been put in place to reduce human contact as much as possible, we believe there is a need to provide a physical guide anytime the trading public requires in-depth understanding of the Ghana National Single Window Systems and Processes. So declarants always have the opportunity to walk into the help desk and physically seek assistance to understand the Ghana National Single Window Processes and Systems and how they operate. As part of this new wind of modernizing and simplifying trade processes and the need for effective collaboration amongst regulatory government agencies and the stakeholders in the value supply chain market, the electronic help desk or e-zone will ensure active and sustained engagement from an array of private sector players to include importers and exporters of all sizes, brokers, forwarders and more. The E-Zone is in line with international global standards, best practices and of course the experiences from stakeholders who are passionate about the establishment of a Ghana national single window environment to facilitate trade, ease of doing business and develop the national economy. So far, the Tema E-Zone or Electronic Help Desk Center and that of the Kotoka International Airport has been built and open to offer assistance to the trading community. With ease, it is expected that all complaints by the trading public will speedily be addressed and there will be no lack of information on the processes of the Ghana National Single Window currently being implemented by customs. Admittedly, modernizing the manual procedures in the trading industry is a big undertaking and an immensely complex challenge. The managers of the Ghana National Single Window have therefore taken the stride to ensure that stakeholders are not in any way left behind as far as information availability is concerned. Thus, the Customs Division of the Ghana Revenue Authority, which is the implementer of the innovative ICT trade facilitation solution called the Ghana National Single Window, 
and has so far done impressively well in its one year of full operation and management wishes to encourage the trading public to call on the e-zone points in both Tema and the KIA centers for any assistance at all times. The E-Zone, or Electronic Help Desk, is first provided solely to demonstrate Ghana's commitment to facilitating trade, to offer declarants the opportunity to walk into the centers and enjoy the services of doing business in Ghana's trading communities. The E-Zones have been placed strategically in the country's ports and borders. The facilities of state-of-the-art payment centers, self-service terminals, and regulatory agencies' inquiry point, among others. They also have Trade Regulatory Inspection Officer's Desk, and Customs Examination Officers Unit, all aimed at assisting with the value and supply chain processes both at the seaports and airports. Customs and its technical partners, West Blue Consulting, believe that with the success achieved so far in implementing the National Single Window, when all other stakeholder agencies and groups come on board the National Single Window project and are well informed, the goals of ensuring smooth and efficient ways of doing business in Ghana and essentially growing the nation's economy to influence development will not be an uphill task to achieve. The managers of the Ghana National Single Window is assuring the trading public the best of services and ease of doing business in Ghana through the National Single Window project. Hence, advantage should be taken of the e-zone or electronic help desk to understand how the processes and systems of the project functions. The implementers of the project are also promising that very soon the e-zone or electronic help desk centers will be opened at the Takrade port and the Aflao border to offer the trading public there the opportunity to understand the Ghana National Single Window project currently being implemented by customs. Therefore, to all importers and exporters and the entire trading public, know that the period of walking around frustrated without knowing where to go and who to contact for inquiries on your business activities in the trading communities is over with the arrival of the Ghana National Single Window E-Zone or Electronic Help Desk Centers. Crazy, I got diamonds on the soul.